Hello everybody. Today we want to present you our actual work. An Aqua Accuset 1000 OLP. Nicely refurbished with a lot of work to have the machine in a superb shape. When we got the machine into our workshop, we installed it, we were imaging one page, the page came out and so it looked fine. But today I want to tell you why only a long term test is reliable. After the first page we were sending 10 pages and what happened after page number 6 suddenly the film stopped here at this position. No movement of the film of course error message media jam and the film was completely blocked. We were looking and saw that within the buffer that you see here the film got blocked. So the buffer did not release the film and we heard some sound coming from the motor located in this part here. So we changed the motor, were again sending several pages. Ooh, same problem again. So if it's not the motor, then it's the main board that causes this error. Here you see the main board. So we were changing the main board to another one and the machine was running fine even after several pages. So we needed this spare part. Another long job was sent to the machine with about 12 pages. It was at about page number 10 when from the main motor who is driving the OLP came weird sound. The motor was driving fast, then he stopped, then he was going slow, going fast again and of course together with media jam from the OLP. As we do our business for more than 10 years we knew very well what had to be done. This problem of crazy motor is coming from the relay. See here the old rally. We exchanged it and now the motor was running fine, soft, smoothly, continuously. Another big job with 15 pages were sent to the machine. The machine was imaging and developing fine, no problems. But when we looked at the back of the machine, the films stuck together. So, out of the drying section, the films did not get dry. The films were wet. And with a look to the main ventilator, we saw that this ventilator did not turn. So, no turning ventilator with signal to do so means the relay is broken. So another relay was changed. After this work we were sending 20 pages to the machine. Every page came out fine, came out dry, with nice quality, good density. The next test for us was to change here on the panel. The temperature and the speed of the developer. And when we move to these buttons, nothing happened. No change at all. Usually, then you have to change the foil here. When the buttons don't work anymore, you must change the foil. So, 
We tried here with another file and the same result. So, if here the buttons don't work even with the new file, then it's inside of this small box. The main bot. Have a look. We also had to change the main bot. And after this change, we could easily go on the buttons, press it, and hear the beep and a change was possible. So, have a look what we all had to do. The rallies, this bot here, the other bot there. And so you see, only a very long term test is giving reliability on the system. Short tests or even a used system without knowledge, if it works at all, is a big waste of money. Just all this work and the big long tests give you the assurance that you will get for your money a well-working and of course a well-looking system. See, this is the OLP looking so nice. Let's have a look inside. New hoses, regeneration pumps refurbished and everything checked and well cleaned. So, whenever you look for a high quality image setter, giving you a good machine for your money, you should contact us and you will have a great return of investment from your money. So, enjoy the video and don't hesitate to contact us. Thank you.